back with a, another video for today. I hope you were doing good since the last one, all hour or two ago. Um, so I'm back in sunny Newport, um, the place of dreams we all know and love, um, at an awesome one bedroom apartment, which we're gonna be man managing for an investor. Um, just got the keys today to this one. This is the first time I've been in all fairness. The team went before. Um, and this is another property sourced by Bespoke Sourcing. So Hannah and Gwyn, shout out to them. If you want decent, not decent, if you want awesome um, rent to service accommodation deals, please check them out. Um, they're really cool guys. And um, yeah, they get, they get great deals and properties like this one, which um, as you'll see, are very easy for us to market. So yeah, we're gonna be managing this one as well. Let me flip around. And I'll sort of start the entrance. So yeah, so um, well, it's a, it's a two bedroom. Um, ground floor apartment. Um, one of the bedrooms currently needs a bit of work, so we're gonna be marketing it initially as a one bedroom place. Um, we'll start off here and what's gonna be the um, bedroom. So, really nice size single bedroom here. Lots of sort of quirky shapes because it's an old old building that's obviously been converted, so there's plenty of things to m work around. And you've got a nice little cubby here for a um, wardrobe or something. Really good standard, you've got some nice spots in the ceiling, nice white paint above, and we've actually uh, lucked out here, you've got semi-decent looking curtain rails, which is gonna save some money. Because um, curtain rails add up, and you've also got a little porthole into what is the toilet. Quite random, but cool. This is the entrance way here. Um, through there's a sort of main kitchen area. Let me get a light on for you. Kitchen, really good. Obviously looks brand new, to be honest. So we've got nice big center island, Lots of get, um, lots of grey, lots of um, yeah, nice, nice worktops. Combi boiler over there. We've got a um, one of those is a dishwasher. And yeah, loads of loads of unit space. Space there for a washing machine, which is awesome. Um, we're gonna have to get a. I'm not sure actually. I don't think there's a fridge in here, so we're gonna have to look at getting a fridge option in. I might be wrong. It might be hidden in one of the cupboards. I won't hunt for it now. And then if we go in a myriad of doors here, let's try and find the light. This is obviously the bathroom. There we go. It's a really nice standard again. Really bright. Yeah, actually, I kind of, I kind of make sense actually. They've got a couple of these sort of little portholes um, just to allow a bit of natural light in. Yeah, really good standard and finish. And, um, yeah, the, the um, per calendar month rent for this is very competitive, so it's a really good investment, actually, in my humble opinion. Uh, behind here, we've got a um, little storage cupboard, so nothing too crazy. And then finally, downstairs, oh, I won't bother going down there, but basically there is another really large bedroom area, um, which, all being well, um, at the moment there's sort of some issues in there, but once they get resolved, that will be another bedroom, so this will go from a one bedroom to a two bedroom, but actually the... It, um, in the rent, the fact that it's only one bedroom at the moment has been factored in, which has reduced the rent significantly. And as you can see, this is a living room, absolutely huge. Hopefully, as you can tell from my echoey voice now, we've got a lovely fireplace here. Big bay looking out into Newport. Um, I mean, absolute no brainer this one. We'll be able to get a couple of sofas in, so one of them will be a sofa bed. So straight out the gate, we're gonna have a double bed in one of the rooms and a sofa bed in here, which will give us a sort of maximum occupancy of four people. Just a really cool, trendy one bedroom apartment right next to the station, right in the center of town. There's actually some parking nearby that's free as well, which is quite compelling, um, because normally it's hard to find any decent parking options here. Um, so yeah, absolutely delighted to be managing this one. Um, managing this on behalf of Claire, so shout out to you. I can see you're watching. Um, in terms of sort of getting this ready, we don't always say to our investors sort of fortnight maximum, but obviously in this instance, um, Got a really big, our, our sort of setup team is growing on a nearly weekly basis at the moment, so all being well, we'll have it ready for guests way before that. Um, but yeah, thanks very much for watching, guys. Just as another minor note, literally since my last live, we've had two bookings one for five thousand pounds and another one for I think it's like two and a half grand. So yeah, um, service accommodation is officially back, so we are literally getting as many units as we can on live now, online now, as quickly as we can because we are completely full. All of our properties in South Wales and England have guests in at the moment. Um, we're getting stuff booked out weeks and months in advance and we're getting some really chunky bookings now which is really cool um because obviously compared to the last three months yeah we're, we're starting to see some really really big numbers so i hope you're having a great day guys and we hope to speak again soon cheers guys bye bye